Hello, welcome back again to another video. And in today's video, we look at a very simple transition and it is called the door opening transition. So let's see how we can do that. Let's place this video clip on the timeline and we want to apply the rotoscoping mask to this video clip. Let's bring in our playhead uh, somewhere here and then go to the Alpha Mast and King and select the rotoscoping mast here and apply it to our clip. Now that we have that, let's go to zoom out here and then uh, let's uh, zoom out from this clip and now place our playhead in the position that we want the transition to take place and then let's go to the video clip and at the best point there and then go to the center of the clip and make a straight line all the way down and then click here and do a right click to close it up so we just mask this part of the clip okay so that's all we need to do for this one and now let's apply the transform effect to this clip so let's go to the transform distort and perspective and then under that we select the transform and apply it to our clip now that we have that let's go to the properties of the transform effect and uh, make sure to place the playhead in the position that you want the transitions to take place and now let's add a keyframe now once we are done with that we want to copy or duplicate this clip so when we copy any effects that we apply to this clip is also copied to the next clip so let's just copy this and paste it here and then bring this one on top of our clip and let's uh, a little bit uh, minimize this and we need to add another video track again so let's do a right click here and insert track which is the video clip track and then move this one all the way up followed by this one here and then let's minimize this and uh, bring in the other video clip that the video will be transitioning into so once we have that um, let's select the top video clip go to the rotoscoping mask and then under the properties here you can see the invert so simply click on the little checkbox to invert the clip so we just close the part that has been uh, blank there and now once we have that now let's zoom in control and the middle mouse button to zoom in and let's just bring our playhead somewhere here and then uh, add the keyframe there in the transform and then in the x value we want to type 2000 so positive moving to your right and negative moving to your left so 2000 means it's gonna move to our right so you can see that we just move to the right here and then let's select the bottom uh, clip here and again do the same add a keyframe but this time in the x value we want to move to the left so it is negative so negative uh, 2000 okay so that's all for this um, little trans so here is the final result of our transition Okay, so that's all for this video and thank you again for watching.